is going on people welcome back johnny here and we are playing some rim hammer the end times with the beast men and these rooms need something in them so i can actually see where the hell anything is but there you go uh why aren't we butchering that dude alex i want you what are you working on there four simple meals that is taking a shitload of time i don't want either of these bros to go bad oh they're frozen <laughs> yeah i guess you can just leave them out there for a while i'm gonna try and keep a nice tidy and small storage room what's the safe temp on these these things should be making their own heat which they do so it's 49 in there 38 outside all right we gotta get the burrows out of the freaking houses too that's not going to be a good play for anybody that may be sleeping in there. Yeah, you burrows just shove off, would you? Did I put a floor under here? There we go. All right, and some of these trees are still just in the way. They look amazing. I'm going to leave that one in the middle and see if we can deal with it. <laughs> it gives a way more beast man like vibe to everything, right? So I'm going to make custom vent. I'll just, I made a one that goes over a wall for the dwarves and it just looks like a, I don't know. It's like a steel vent that pops over a wall. So for the beastman, I can just make it look like a hole in the wall or something. <laughs> I think that'll look cool. Now we're using a ton of bone here. So hopefully our value drops off. What is this? This is creatures. This must be some stupid. This is probably just the skills of our pawns. This is buildings because we're building buildings. Oh, you know what? I need to make sure at this point that my mod settings are set right. I forget that every time. We should be getting a boost for the herd being strong. Um, There it is. Herd is strong. Plus 20. Pow. So if we can keep our items virtually non-existent hopefully we'll be all right and i'm tempted to add some code at some point to make it so that the magic items don't muck that up either all right this little trail out there too so that when people come kill us they have a nice fast path to get to us <laughs> using the blackened bone outside and the bleached bone inside the white whatever bone inside this I mean, we could mine that out. We did the butchering. That's great. That means we have a ton more leather. Everything's going so slow here. But things seem... Wait, oh, shit. What's wrong with Ilya? You dumb, dumb, dumb bastard. What are you doing over there? Why did you go over there? You got bit, didn't you? Oh, no. You just got... A, you were just scared by them. Okay, cool, cool. At least it didn't wake the bastards up. What happened to our little buddy? There he is. He is good till negative 13 because he's a big, furry, beasty son of a bee. Have we tamed any other animals? No, I don't even know if we're working on taming animals at this point. Construction botched all over the place. <laughs> I don't know why that's happening. This tree could certainly come out. Man, we have so much wood. We need more bonfires. <laughs> Here, it's cold in these rooms, so why not just go ahead and stick campfires in there? And then I could do it in... He I don't want to put one in each of these rooms. It's actually just that torch is keeping it relatively warm. This room's pretty cold, though. Let's put one in here. Right next to Arkin's bed. We'll see how that goes for him. And all the gear that we had... Oh, wait. No, it didn't. Hemlock, finish that for me. He should burn all this gear that's laying around. Just throw it on the bonfire, buddy. Fantastic. It's all tainted, so it's not really worth a lot anyways, but it is what it is. I'm going to allow wood in here, too. Seems like we have a ton of wood laying around, and we're going to need it at some point, the way things are going. We're really cooking through the bone we have, which I guess is also good. Not literally cooking, but we're using it. In fact, I don't think we have enough to complete everything I put in there. All right, let's put some torches in here because that'll use 
more material as well. <laughs> and what else do we need to do? I'm going to move this guy. That's an awful plain leather. Let's see if we can do better. So furniture, crude cat, human leather. Let's put that in. And then are these awful as well? I guess it doesn't really matter. They're going to work equally well whether they're awful or not. And that awful one I'll just take apart or something. And let's see if we can't make misc, nope, beastmen. There we go. Pile of human leather is a commune spot. And then at least they won't be getting disturbed sleep all the time. They're focusing on those floors, but they should be out of bone before too long here. And what? Alex is asleep. Ilya is working on the floors. Everybody else is tight. Down for the night. Okay, this dude rotted. That sucks. I don't want anything rotten in here. So allow rotten. Boom. Can I burn a rotten mouse? Add bill. Burn corpse. Do forever. Details. I don't want to do any human legs. We're just going to burn rotten animals. Wide open. Oh, let's see if that works. Alex, what are you working on? Refueling the bonfire, okay. Uh, work at the bon... Alright, look at that. He's going to burn that rotten mouth. Throw it on the fire. Nice. Very nice. Uh, we have a steel club. I'm going to let that sit for now. Is it? It's, they're not worth a lot. You like how I'm like, holy shit, $51? <laughs> you like how I'm totally micromanaging the crap out of this? So there was a burn weapons thing over here. No, there wasn't. I haven't burned any weapons yet. Uh, I think I'm going to do it. I think we should burn that. So burn weapon. Do forever. Details. Clear all. Melee. It's going to waste some steel, but that's okay. So right now we're just going to burn clubs. So if I tell Hemlock, who is actually recreating at the massive fire... Ilya's chilling. I'm surprised nobody's cold. Maybe they are. It's 11 bloody degrees. Uh, gear. Let's get to 18, and it's below that, so he's not comfortable that much, I can tell you. Hopefully somebody does some butchering. Oh, I'm seeing more hearts flying around. I've never, never gotten a Beastman couple. Hemlock Wood Arkin. <laughs> The Ungor is trying to get frisky uh, with the Bray Shaman. That's fantastic. You have no idea how comical that is to me. All right, good. He's going to burn the club. There you go. Tossed it right in. It's gone. Let's keep an eye on this. So we've totally leveled out now. Despite, and I bet a part of that. Hold on. Yeah, so look at this. And that's because we used all the bone. No one's building this shit. I don't know why. What's Arkans asleep? Health. These stupid muscle parasites never go away, right? Forty-five years later, they're still struggling with this issue. What? What is this? Oh, did we tame a rat? Did I miss a message? Huh. All right. Well, you can just go to the animal zone, little buddy. Nah, forget it. We'll let them wander for now. If we have a ton of animals, when we finally get the herd stone done, we'll be able to do some nice stuff right away in terms of murdering, sorry, yeah, murdering animals in the name of the dark gods. Man, there's just wood everywhere. I guess we'll bring it in. They're flubbing construction like nobody's business, too. How are we doing for meals? We have plenty. I'm going to have to set up some kind of cooler again like I did last time. It worked out really well to leverage winter air man why do we keep getting raided so much i guess it's oh shit there's three bros four bros or five even yeah five people coming in that's that's problematic arkin should be able to account for two of them really quickly by himself though with this here purple bolt that we're gonna blast their asses with oh shit they're trying to kill our donkos we're gonna have to creep on them You. Blast. Ah, that did not do as much damage as we needed to. I'm going to 
Orange fire. And let's blast this dude. All right, he's down and up. We can do a purple bolt again. That's two of them. Hemlock's taking a shot. Here, you have a shield. Go over there and mess with him. Uh, what's green bolt do? Drive him into a mad rage. All right, it actually killed him. Well, we're not going to complain. That dude's running, but we're not going to let him get away. Pur ah, we don't have enough magic power stored. All right, you're good to go. You get out of here. I should have sent my melee dudes over. All right, there's a... No, one of them got away. That's okay. We'll burn all these bows or some... Burn that silver. All right, I think I had a job for burning resources here. Just want to make sure that stays near the top of the list. Should just be silver right now. It is good. We don't need silver. His shield's still on. <laughs> So if someone tries to shoot him while he's sleeping, he's totally covered here. Our donkey could use some tending. All right, somebody tended it. Um, let's do misc. No, I guess animal sleeping spots are under furniture. Chop that tree out of there. Build a roof so these little bastards have somewhere to go. Beastman certainly wouldn't care about where the donkey slept, but, I mean, whatever. It's cool. Can you burn these weapons? Where are you going? Feeding a simple meal to donkey, too. <laughs> now where are you headed? Building a roof. Let's burn. Oh, what are you doing? It's going to burn all that shit. But those bows, now where are you going? Building a roof. Okay, are those all short bows? We have seven short bows. So burn weapon details. That's not under melee. That's going to be under ranged and short bow. Those are awful. Normal, poor, poor, poor. Somebody of ours, you have a poor one. I want you to come over here and equip this. What else did we have? We had a crossbow, a Dowie crossbow we pulled from somewhere. Probably when we went and raided that camp earlier. All right, what are you going to work on now, buddy? We should have the humans to butcher to get all the bones we need to finish the rest of this crap. The bone mod's great. It plays really well with this. The fact that my pawns suck at construction, on the other hand, is not great. I mean, he's a six, but he sure botches them. Does he have health issues? Oh, yeah, it's his muscle parasite. So there you go. I'm going to let it cruise for a bit. Let's see what we can accomplish yet today. Was burning things actually working really well? I didn't force Hemlock to do this. He's just set the hall at a good priority and he gets it done. And you can see our item wealth is dropping off the more he burns. So that's fantastic. What is that? That is pemmican. I'm okay if that stays outside. I don't really care. Still working on finishing all these stupid paths I put in. We need to get around though. Like this is just out of hand. I'm debating on putting roofs over to cover all the paths so that the snow doesn't inhibit us too much, but we're doing all right. It's going to be way too hot in these rooms now. i got to get those vents made next time for next time. Wait, why, Okay, why do we stop making brined meat? Details. Meat. It's because why we're not using dwarf, gore, human, or insect. That's what's going on. And I don't want to use chaos. I don't know if the taint will carry over. Probably not. All right, that should get my cooks busy. All this meat's going to bloody go to waste. Which I did not foresee somehow. <laughs> All right, now, now we're getting brine meat. Man, that job is so stinking slow. Are you just a shitty cook? Do you have reduced manipulation? Yeah, it's not helping anything. What if I put somebody else on that same task? Against my better judgment, but I don't want the meat to go bad. I really, if we just put the meat outside, it would be fine. Okay, I think this room is done, so let's get all this wood hauled out of here. This is going to be for Arkin. I'm going to get rid of this commune spot in exchange for the human leather commune hide pile. All right, there goes our meat. Bloody hell. 
Architect stockpile zone. Critical clear. Raw food. Meat. Somebody want to get that shit moved for me? What's, why is it selecting this one I do? The, oh, there's meat there. <laughs> where are you going with that, buddy? You want to put it over here where it belongs? There we go. All right, get that one moved too. All right, we're getting back to making our fur mantles, which should have been done ages ago. That means we've run out of bone for making our walkways. But Arkin has his own room. It's not terribly cold in there. It's not warm, but it's not too bad. He likes to hear the donkeys in the night. That's why he's so close to them. This shit should deteriorate, but not... Oh, the rat's going to eat it, but that's okay. <laughs> the rat will become food one day. Man, and our stuff is... Let's go double check where we're at. Oh, look at that. It's beautiful. It's dropping off. It's probably because we're making stuff with that human meat. I need to make that job take less work. That's taken way, way, way too long. All right, that'll be fixed. I have to remember to fix it in the Empire because they can make jerky too. You can rotate these, and maybe I should have. Like, it'll just kind of mix them around a bit so they don't look identical. Uh, scratch that. They do look identical. <laughs> just moves your workspace around a little bit. Anybody awake? No. Hey, we do have a fur mantle finished now. Is that human leather fur mantle? Oh, that's just gross. Uh, let's refuel this. No, no, let's shit. You have to have to click on the brine meat. All right, hang on. Okay, he's doing it right. <laughs> good, 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 good. There you go. And it's pretty cold in there. I don't want it to get too hot, though. I guess I'm going to let it go. Hopefully that meat doesn't get spoiled. This meat we could at least roof over, and then it won't go bad so fast. That's home area. We want rough. There. Yeah, okay. Also, with the whole, like, walkway thing, I might as well, right? You can't roof over a bonfire. It'll tell you. That's no bueno. Oh, we have an auto save. Oh, shit. It totally let me do it. Shouldn't do that. You definitely can't build them under a roof. So maybe after the... Roof is there. You can... Let's remove that. I want that tree to stay. Maybe after the item's already there, it will let you put them? I don't know. This will also come in handy later on when we get... Can cast storms and all that stuff going on. Our steel isn't... Hasn't been hauled in yet either, but I guess that's okay. Didn't I put a... A little walkway... Over here somewhere. I wish I could see my floors. Architect. Floors. Blackened bone. Alright. Yeah, that might have been an oversight. <laughs> well, they're getting there. The herd has grown a bit. We could start deconstructing shit, but I feel like we have our hands full. It's a bone wall anyway. We don't want to mess with that. I do need to do a bunch of research. Anybody wearing the fur mantles yet? There's one. Hopefully we're not burning them right away. <laughs> you have to watch that shit, man. Okay, no, he put it on. Look at that. So he's got fur mantles. So there should be three more being made. I don't know. One of them just disappeared somewhere. Maybe I didn't make that many. What's your gear looking like? You're good till neg 24. I think you'll be fine. Okay, I'm going to let it cruise a bit. I think I'll build some more of these over here, actually. We'll be ready. Oh, shit. That's not where I want it. We'll be ready for our next pawn. And these things are totally unnecessary for beastmen. They help them rest, rest better, but totally could just go without those. But <laughs> it just makes it feel more rim world to have a proper bedroom set up. But like these dudes don't care. This bedroom is awful. He could give a shit. He is happy that the herd is strong. One thing these do is add some wealth. Oh, the rare thrombos are here. But they're worth almost nothing. That one's worth $15 because it's a shitty beast man table. 
I don't think our magic is going to be enough to bring those dudes down. And I think unless we get raided and need to piss them off to fight off some raiders, we just shouldn't even get involved with those dudes. <laughs> All right, well, Alex is busy cooking. The food shouldn't spoil because it's outside and it's therefore frozen. Well, welcome to camp, boners. Why don't you guys eat a bunch of these trees to help me out a little bit here? They would probably provide a shit ton of bones. I can't risk it, though. Like I don't want to get run over this early. I do want to let it cruise for a bit and make some progress here. Let me know what you think about the bonfires. And, like, the mod in general now. It's really come a long way. I've added, like, 30 things since the beginning of the last playthrough. So that's pretty awesome progress. Make sure this dude's meditating yet. Okay. I just have to test to make sure that this thing's working right. Like he recognizes it and will use it. Is that other bro still on the table? No, he buggered off. What's happened to this guy? Oh. Oh. Oh, it's just the little ones that aren't getting by in this cold. Oh, well. It's only eight bloody degrees, too. Shooting frenzy for arc in it. Oh, low food, you say. Uh, okay, I mean, that makes this, well, that makes the donkey even more tempting. I, I'm going to try and bring one of these guys down. They're nice and separated now. I might be able to do it. <laughs> I should probably promote that spell first, but here we go. All right, he is pissed. Indigo fire. That's the big one. We better use that one last. How bad did that wound him? Not bad at all. Oh, shit. That's bad. You, hit him. You, get the hell out of there. Uh, Purple bolt is ass again. Alex has been slumped. Can I do anything else? That's indigo fire. That's too dangerous in this close quarters. Green bolt... Drive an enemy into a mad rage. Well, it's already in a mad rage. You dudes maybe back up a little bit. See if Alex can handle this. He's melee level 10 now. He is frail. This isn't going to go well. Oh! <laughs> they did it. You guys are awesome. Check that out, dude. That's food for days right there. Alex, why don't you go get yourself tended up here? You put the... Put that stuff in there, would you? I don't know why they only carry a really small amount at a time, but... Ha! I feel pretty decent about that. Maybe we should make the axe bigger on this thing. Like, it's really tiny. I mean, if you know what it is, you know what it is. What is that noise? Oh, I, I don't even know what that was. Oh, more abandoned technology. I've just been leaving this for now. Back there, there's a Skaven Warp Fire Thrower, so there's a few on the map now. We're just going to let him go, though. Where's my butcher? Oh, I guess Alex is my butcher. Did he get tended? Uh, thankfully, he didn't go down. <laughs> I don't know what finally killed it. It must have been the magic, right? We're casting a shitload of spells, so it's a good thing we have this Bray Staff. Otherwise, we certainly would have miscast. If you, have a, if you don't have a... A brace staff, it's like one in a hundred. If you do have a brace staff, it's like one in a thousand that you're going to miscast. And that goes the same for Empire and their wizard staffs. What is that? That must be the thrumbo, dude. Damn it. <laughs> it's got to be the thrumbo. No, we just kill that thrumbo. What could this be? Uh, where's those fur mantles? How much are those worth? Doesn't say what it's worth. Well, hopefully those aren't worth a shit ton. I think I set all the gear to be not worth a lot, I, but you never know if you overlooked something or not. Like, let's check out his wizard gear here. It doesn't tell you the market value on these things, which is unfortunate. Work to make. Alright, this room. <laughs> Alex, come over here and butcher this thing, buddy. Let's see if that makes any difference. It's really fun tracking this because I have no bloody idea. Yeah, that must have been the thrumbo. Oh, we got a ton of bones off of it. 105 and a mountain of meat too. Holy shit, that's a lot of meat. I'm going to wrap this zone around. 
And then maybe I can build a roof over there. Just to try and keep it protected. Cannot build a roof over a twisted tree. Well, that's your opinion, man. Okay, sweet. And next time I play, I'll this will go faster. That's pretty stinking slow. That seems absurd, right? Ooh, let's burn that thrumbo horn. We certainly don't want that laying around. Burn item. Details. Thrumbo horn. There you go. Uh, Arkin, this... I should make those sacrificable to the gods, right? Go over there and burn that thing right away. All right, there you go. That'll help our wealth. <laughs> I should see that because items shot up when that thing died because it probably counted as us having it. So hopefully that was the issue. All right, yeah, we're going to cruise for a bit. We should be set with meat for a little while here. Someone's attacking the victors. Uh, looks like some human schmucks. I put that cloak in the game, and all of a sudden everybody shows up wearing it. I'm not complaining, but <laughs> I don't know how that happens. I should build some barricades or something. That or get my trap stuff set up, because this shit's getting a little bit out of hand. Where you dicks at? Oh, you think you're going to hang out down there for a quick minute, do you? Let's gather up first. Probably come for me pretty quick here. Stay together. Alex, not moving too quick with this frail. Oh, you know what? If I hit that thing, it'll blow up. Cause a bunch of problems. But I think for the minute, I'm going to. Oh, shit. I'm zoomed way out. We have no range here. Here we go. Come get some, boy. All right. He's, he's done. <laughs> All right. And. That spell will regen really fast. You want some too, partner? And they are beginning their assault. We should be able to do pink fire of Zinch. Give him the business. And you and... You're the only melee dude I have anymore. Go over here. Uh, that dude... That's probably a bad idea. Alright, and can I hit that guy on his way out? Not very well, but decently. You guys go over there. I want all these humans picked up and their weapons too. Man, there's just shit everywhere again. All right, let's go find a priority hall job. That weapon will take this dude. I just want the weapons to get burned. I don't want to leave them on the map because that's just value. That's Indigo fire is too far away. All right, now he's berserk. <laughs> Take that, you son of a bitch. We're hitting the trees only. We're not hitting him. Ah, oh, good. There he goes. All right, you strip melee attack him to death. You're free to go. You guys are free to go as well. Fantastic. Get him. Get him good, human bastard. Coming over here trying to kill us. Certainly couldn't blame him. Like, if... There was a beast man colony near my house. I'd definitely go try to destroy it. <laughs> Probably bring some friends. I'm going to deconstruct this bed. And I am going to build a few more of these chairs in here too. This I hate that you can't reinstall a torch. That drives me nuts. That's one of those rim world quirks that I don't get it. But it's fine. Now those guys should get butchered. I am going to build a room over here to keep the meat in. I think that would help us out quite a bit. Especially in the winter when things will actually stay frozen. And I don't know whether we have the bones. Well, we have some bones around. Alex chilling out watching some TV. <laughs> that are staring at the fire. Um, let's go ahead and just put the roof. No, I can't until they get some walls built. Never mind. All right, they should have all that shit brought up. They should have everything broken down. We have all these chunks. Tell me there's... Okay, let's stop bringing chunks in at this point. This shit's getting out of hand. Cancel all those. There you go. That should help us a bit. All right, we're getting the last of our floors put in. And we're getting meals. 
I wouldn't mind if we butchered these people before they rotted. It says they're refrigerated. So I guess that's okay. I'm keeping this room open in case somebody else comes along. Man, we need more pawns so bad. <laughs> Collection of treasure. Well, that's... What's there no storage space for? The bows? Oh, the humans or the bows. We'll get to that. We'll definitely get to it. I'll tell you what. I'm going to let it cruise again. We'll see what we can accomplish. Did that thrumbo disappear? Oh, there's a mad buck. Did you do your meditation? He did. Of course he did. They're really good at that since I fixed it. It's coming from the south. Arkin, get ready. You're you're the bro here. And where's that purple bolt? Oh, it didn't go down, but it doesn't seem to be mad anymore. <laughs> but because it came here, it's the will of the dark gods that we murder it. There you go. Off you go. More stuff to butcher. More meat to go in here. Life is good. Now, can we... Oh, God. Somebody want to burn all this shit for me? Do I have jobs for this stuff? Yeah, I believe I do. Like, everything looks good. All right. Oh, I actually... Here. Uh, work at this. Let's get a bunch of crap. There's bows. I'm going to burn that knife, too. We don't want that shit around at this point. Where's the weapons? I'm doing it one at a time because they're... I just don't want to end up burning some shit that I didn't mean to burn. And that's really going to chat my ass. All right, there you go. Come over here and try again. Well, we... This one's awful. Um, whatever. I'm going to leave it for now in case we get another pawn and whatever. I could totally build another one, though. All right, let's just burn awful stuff too. Add a bill, burn apparel, do forever, details. Oh no, allow all, but anything, anything awful. I wish you could put names on those so it was obvious like what you were doing. What's Arkin working on here? Oh, yeah, because I set up more construction jobs, buddy. Nothing else is happening. He probably needs to be tended now. No, he just went to bed because it's the middle of the afternoon. <laughs> oh, maybe that's making him more tired. Let's see. Is that the case? Uh, no, doesn't seem to be. All right, something just got burned, so that's good. Can we seriously butcher these dudes? Not refrigerated. I'm going to take this whole wall out here. Just have a big mighty space for hanging out. I can get some big tables put in. Maybe I'll divide it off later. I don't want all this wood either. I want to separate that out into, or alter it to be bone. Hey, Arkin's back. We're out of meals, but we have tons of material. Temperatures are fine for the most part inside. Yeah, it's at least 60 everywhere. How's it? Oh, because it's a small room and there's a torch burning. That's how that one's staying so warm. Oh, somebody set up a nearby homestead. Sadly, I just can't get over there right now. There's too much shit to do. So we butcher people. It drops a bunch of gear. And then if you have a pawn set to haul, look at that shit. It all just gets taken out and burned right away. That's fantastic. No junk that you have to dump in the water. A little extra pawn time, but totally worth it, man. Just to get rid of stuff that you certainly don't need or want. And we actually got enough bones to get all the stuff done that we need to do. I'm going to put a zone in here right now. There. I need a door on there, too. Beastmen love the bone, man. And then this stuff is going to get copied paste it in there it's going to take them 45 minutes to get all them trees out of there and then they're going to have to dink around forever cutting out yeah cutting out all those trees but i guess it is what it is that stupid donkey went in there and stopped that dude from working clear animals no donkeys in here thank you 
Uh, so far, we're holding our own really well. It's, it doesn't seem nearly as difficult as it did last time. <laughs> Let's check our value. We're staying pretty steady. I mean, we've definitely gone up, and it's still items, and we don't have anything to show for it. It's all these leathers, but it's something like this shit right here. Look at this. Worth 14 bucks each. You should probably just burn that, right? Why are they putting wood in there? Oh, okay, never mind. That just happens to be there. Because <laughs> they're chopping down trees. All right, this zone is going to go. And this room should maintain an outside temperature. What? Okay, it's not warmer in there. It's just warmed up outside, that's all. Why is it 44 degrees outside now? It wasn't getting that warm before. Before I built this little freezer, I mean, not really a freezer, but... Holy shit, do we have a lot of meat. <laughs> okay, look at this. So we have four dwarfs coming in, but two new pawns. Sickane and Voltraz. Vilcomen, mein Freund, and... Uh, okay, you dudes, do we have any weapons or do we actually get rid of everything? <laughs> so we have this. Where's that club? Didn't this? He, oh, he's still carrying it. Never mind. All right. He, unless you're really good at shooting. No, you're going to be a melee dude. You're going to be a shooter, but I don't. I think we burned all the weapons we had. <laughs> all right. So there's that. We need to get bedrooms for these these lads. So let's give this to the gore. Set owner skein. We're going to need a few more of those fur mantles. I'm not going to make a bunch of loincloths until we need them. Somebody needs treatment. Hemlock. That's not good. These guys have to be named after patrons, too. All right, problem solved. Zazzle and Corneal Boater, welcome to the colony, my friends. Uh, let's hope these dicks are halfway decent at something. We have a doctor. Yeah, skill four is pretty solid for a beastman. I'm going to hold off on the Hall Plus until we see if there's anything else they're decent at. You're a handler with a passion. That'll be... I'm going to work through this. You don't want to be bored to death, right? All right, done. Here's where we ended up in case you want to see. The Carex clans are here. There they are. We should probably get ready for this shit. Uh, did that dude grab his weapon? Zazzle, yes. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah, I should make some kind of barricades or traps or some shit. This is going to get out of hand quick. Back up. You, give me that purple bolt. Hit him. Did not do the damage we needed it to, but he's wounded, so we're going to let it go. You, hit this guy. All right, that dude's dead. We got a badass hammer, too. <laughs> All right, Arkin. Arcus Invictus. Patron. Ultimito. Oh shit, the dude's in there smashing up our fire. Take that, you son of a bitch. Oh, this guy's actually made it to us, you dudes. Get him. Alright, let's... Ooh, yeah, look at those awesome Dowie weapons. Let's get that equipped. You drop that piece of shit and come get this hammer. Did they bring a bow? Did any of those dudes drop a bow? Oh, look at that. That's freaking phenomenal. We're going to keep that around for a little while. Bodar? Now, they didn't bring up crossbow. Do you have a crossbow on you? What are you equipped with? A little crappy hand axe. How many of them were there? Oh, yeah, there's only... Okay. All right, well, let's get the dead ones hauled. And this guy's a slayer. And I need some type of ranged weapon for this guy. I don't think I can craft anything right now. No. Oh, I can make a short bow. I guess beggars can't be choosers. So if we had a miner, actually, this would be really good. Somebody who, are you a miner? You're you're probably doing some mining. Let's give him that. Hey, go go over there and equip that. Did I set that guy to mine? That's uh, Zazzle and mine it is, partner. But we definitely want to keep this weapon. So let's get that brought in. Get that hauled and then equip that Dowie shield. And then you're free to go. You're free. You're free. This will bring in. I'll probably end up destroying the spear. All right, we'll get that brought in. There's some silver that they left us. We want to make sure that gets thrown into the trash. 
heap. All right, I think we're doing fine. <laughs> ah, stupid asses. I'll probably put a wall here and try and segregate the storage somewhere. We need more space, man. We don't have any room to work. Shit, I left Bodar standing around outside. And I am going to get rid of that spear. Bills, burn weapon, details, spear, spear, spear. There you go. Bodar doesn't have a bed. Mm -hmm. We have to make more huts. All right, one more damn thing to do. For now, we're going to put him in here. Set him up a little space. He should be fine with the situation. I guess also what I should do is put a sleeping spot so that he actually goes in there and sleeps right away. <laughs> uh, Bodar, sorry, partner. All right, well, cheers to the patrons once again. Arcus, Invictus, Ilya, Ermakov, Zazel, Hemlock, Mike Ferrer, Natasio, Dimitri, River Kid, Garrett, Chew on Disc, Excelsior, Thauburn, Josh Grace, a raccoon has self-tamed, you say. All right, well, put it with the other animals over here. I don't know what happened to our rat. Those dudes might have killed it. I lost my place. Chew on Disc, Excelsior, Thauburn, Josh Grace, Shiggy, Covert Samurai, Viking Brandon, Tyronix, Typhios, Dapper Goix, Alexander, Henry Wallace, Michael Rakestraw, Dirtle Dave, and Cornel Boater. I love you guys. I very much thank you for your support. Port. Let's get rid of this piece of crap. All right, and the herd grows. Now, it's going to be hard to track the wealth the more pawns we get. This is wealth and creatures, and it didn't go up yet. But if you close and reopen, then sometimes it'll... Oh, there it is. So it registered it right away. And this. This is the material that came off those Dowie as well. So we have to get that shit dealt with. Um, hopefully, we're butchering those dudes. Is it cold out? Yes, yeah, 20 degrees. It's frozen in here. Work. I thought I just put another cook on. I did. All right, this guy is going to be turned off from cooking. We don't want Arkin doing any cooking. Ah, oh, yeah, these weapons are boss right here, man. Let's make sure no one has a melee weapon other than that. What are you making? He's making the bow. Yeah, we're good. We are golden. Dowie weapons are tip-top shape. All right, you know what? I want this stuff butchered before I forget. We've made a short bow. I don't know where it ended up. Uh, there it is. Bodar, you're going to equip this short bow when you're done with that. Hope you don't have a mental break halfway through. Hey, a goat self-tamed. Okay, with the self-taming of the animals already, that's getting a little out of hand, but we have space for them. Need to make more huts, clearly. We have two people making meat wide opens. Oh, shit. Yaks! One yak. Oh, there's two. We're going to deal with that next time. Please leave a like if you're enjoying. Leave a comment that do respond. Next time, there should be some tweaks to make this even more enjoyable. <laughs> I'll see you guys.